Hello, hello, family. I welcome you to Sons and Daughters of Prophet Tibet Angel. Please, if you are new to our channel, show us love by subscribing, liking, sharing, and commenting on our content. In this video, we are combining two videos, separate video of our Father His Excellency Ambassador Hubert Angel and Pastor Benahim on how they encounter Michael the Archangel. Uh, they shared a revelation on their encounter with Michael the Archangel. So uh, I don't want to waste most of the time. We we'll listen to that of our Father His Excellency Ambassador Hubert Angel. Then we we'll listen to that of Benahim. So please don't forget to subscribe. God bless you. In Malawi, I had visited my son, Prophet Shepard Bushiri. And as I was in this hotel, I'm ready to go to the service, night service. It was a surprise for him and a surprise for the people. They didn't know I was there. And the angel Michael appeared in the room. Now hear this now. We're talking about Michael appearing in the room. Michael. You know Michael? Archangel Michael. And I looked at the wings. They looked like, like, they, were, like they were swords. Every tip of the wing, every feather you can think of is, 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 a, is a sword. It's a knife. I looked at his face. He looked like a knife. The eyes were weapons. The legs, weapons. Feet, weapons. You look at the knees. They were all weapons. It was an armory. It was, it was an armory of only knives and swords. Hear this. When I looked at him, he was a whole weapon. One weapon. You look at the ears. It's a weapon. You can't touch anything and not be pricked. And I'm sitting there going like, oh my God. And the Lord said, this is Michael. I had thought of Michael with wings, with this thing. No, the Michael I saw was just one big sword. Hear this. Yet the Bible says, aren't all angels ministering spirits? Watch this. Then it says, is Michael not the prince of Israel? You don't get this. In other words, Michael is only given to Israel, not to anyone. Yet I'm in Malawi. No, you're not getting it. Sit down. How am I making it in Malawi with Michael far from Israel? That means Michael had no idea he wasn't in Israel. I had created an, a certain atmosphere that made Michael to think it is his territory in Israel. You didn't get it. You didn't get it. You didn't get it. Sit down before you get this. Sit down. Sit down. So, so Michael, who is above Israel, is looking at me thinking I'm an Israelite. And he looks at the hotel. He thinks he's in Israel. So his power now, his extension of his power, is now put towards my habitation, which is in Malawi. But if you ask Michael, Michael, why are you here? He says, what's wrong with you? I'm in Israel. No, you didn't hear me. I'm about to finish because it's not getting in. I can see it's not getting in. Listen to me. I don't preach things that you need to think about or get in your spirit in a certain way or get in your mind. So now, no. family, that is our father's encounter with Archangel. Michael. So now let's listen to that of Benahim, his encounter with the Archangel Michael. Let's hear his own experience. So wonderful, so powerful. So please stay tuned and watch that of Pastor Benahim. Now look, I began preaching when I was 21. I'm 69 now, so 21 years old. I said, Lord, I don't know if I want to preach. <laughs> I think the Lord was really laughing when I said that to him. You know, God has an amazing sense of humor. So I said, Lord, I don't know that I want to preach because I don't want the devil to become real. I'm not really looking for that. Because I knew the second you pray for the sick, the minute you become uh, a minister of the gospel in the, in the way where the supernatural flows through you, the demonic will become real. It's a very powerful world out there. And I said, Lord, I don't think I want that. Let me just, you know, do, do something for you and kind of simple, you know. So I'm asleep. And suddenly in my room, before God Almighty, I'm telling you the truth, okay? Because God will judge me if I add anything to us. 
do it or take away anything. In front of me, I, I woke up. I was wide awake. I woke up. I see this massive being in front of me with a black hood, black robe. I didn't see his face. Nails that were quite long and kind of curly. And he came at me to choke me. This spirit of death is really what it was. So I cried, Dear Jesus! And suddenly, to my shock, I came out of my body. Only half of me came out of my body. I'm sitting up. My legs are still in. From the waist, I'm up. I look back, I see myself. Motionless. Did I die? I don't know. Frankly, I don't care at all because I was alive. But that thing behind me was completely motionless. Dead or not, it doesn't matter. I'm sitting up. And suddenly an angel before the Lord may strike me dead if I'm telling you that anything that's, that is not truth. An angel rushes in, takes that big thing and sh shoves him towards the wall. And that angel was a little bit shorter than that big guy. It didn't matter though, he held him. And then another angel comes in and stands right next to me. Beautiful angel. Oh, blonde hair. You'll see when I, we get to heaven, I'm going to show them to you. Blonde hair. Curly blonde hair. Wide, beautiful eyes, blue eyes. On his chest was a belt of gold. Massive shoulders. He stood maybe seven foot, I don't know how tall he was. I'm staring at him in awe, complete awe. Never seen anyone like that in my life. And he just stared at me. He didn't say a word. He didn't even smile. He just stood there. Now that black robed angel was still there, fighting, trying to, to come my way and choke me. <laughs> he couldn't even move that man or that devil, whatever he was. And a third angel comes in and says, and says to the beautiful angel in front of me, he called him Michael. He said, Michael, twice he said, he said, Michael, Michael, someone else is in trouble. And he says to him with this deep voice comes out of him, he says, you look after him and gone. The second he is gone, I'm back in my body singing, hallelujah. Thank you family for watching this video and if you are new to our channel please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification button to get alert on our future video. May the God of Prophet Hubert Angel bless you and keep